Well, guys, here we are. It's reunion time. We get to finally see where everyone is a year later. And uh, should we do predictions right now? Just, ah, yeah. All right, so I keep getting copyrighted on this episode, so I'm going to stall some time, but I'm just going to play a little snippet from a song we dropped on Patreon. Skip to the timestamp on screen if you don't care and just want to get straight into the episode. As I walk past this gal dump, each one calling me handsome. Stroke my ego that's a fandom. Left on red Danny Phantom. She wanna know what's in my funny? I said no, it's in yours. If we went to a music festival, would I be able to carry you on my shoulder? <laughs> <laughs> what is he, what is she laughing at? What? That wasn't even that funny. Hello. Nah, it sounds like you're trying a little too hard. Hey babe. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I'm definitely into it. This is not deserved. They, they don't show up anywhere in the actual show. They don't have the honor to sit in the pod. Exactly. If you do not commit to the Love is Blind experiment, then you don't get the honor of sitting on a Love is Blind pod couch. Hey ladies, you almost ready? <laughs> we were born ready. The better question is, are they ready? Oh brother, we should have just cut straight to the damn thing. I don't want to watch this. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get to it. I can't wait, but first, come on with me. They're trying too hard. Just cut to the reunion, man. It's exciting. Okay, I can't wait to get out there. Let's do this. Let's go. Nick, Vanessa, we don't care about this you that much. This is so boring. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Oh, my God. Wait, that kind of went uh, uh, yeah. yeah. That kind of went hard. That to the audience to go. We didn't even get invited to, like, go on in the crowd. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the article. Wow. They look wow. Good. Wait, 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 wait. They, they didn't walk out together, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting like, oh, they're coming from everywhere. Coming yeah, from all sides. Can we have like slow introductions? We're so excited to have you guys and to see some familiar faces. <laughs> Welcome, guys. Good to see you, everybody. We're going to. All these people are kind of forgettable, I'm not going to lie. They're still together. I can't believe they're still together. That that's crazy. We'll be addressing every single scandal that has been gripping you over the past few weeks. So what do you guys- <laughs> have a Trevor countdown? Oh, in lockdown. prison. Yeah. Because he got exposed. But what color are your nails? Are you are you not oh, painting they're... them red anymore? We're not here for nails. We're here for drama. Lots of questions, of course, for AD to come, including what happened with Clay after the altar, and has she met up with Clark Kent? Oh, God. Oh, God. Matthew. Yeah, where's Matthew at? There's no way Matthew pulls up. Before you walked down the aisle with your dad and your brother, yeah. I was getting choked up, but I looked over and got me. tears are coming down his face. Nick, you pussy. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. I know that it looks like we worship our men, but in reality, they are worshiping <laughs> us. <laughs> they worship Look, the ground that we walk on. All right, bro, this reunion sucks. <laughs> Welcome to Love is Blind. Okay, this season is- Season one! Yeah, this is a weird scene. Nothing's ever gonna top season one, dude. <laughs> Will you marry me? Oh my god, yes. That dude blocked me on Instagram. <laughs> yeah, he kept trying to fuck his wife. What? <laughs> I was asking nicely. I said, can I please have your wife? And then I got blocked. I love you so much, bless. <laughs> they, they were the highlight of that season, dude. <laughs> they were so goofy, bro. Me and you. <laughs> me and you. And the father of my baby. <laughs> Gigi's brunette now? Jeremy, aloha. Digging the shirt. Hawaiian shirt. I respect it. Yes, I am seeing someone. Funny you should mention that. She actually is here today. Guys, should we should we bring her out? It's gonna be Sarah Ann. Dude. Yeah, that's it has to be, Sarah. right? There's no way it's not Sarah Ann. Oh. Let's please welcome Sarah Ann. <laughs> oh. oh, not the kid. It's not that problematic. Come I on. know, it's love is blind. And plus, after the, f the the bean thing, are we really feeling bad for Laura after telling him to flick 80s boob? And think about the jet skis. Yeah, they bonded. She is in Barcelona, Spain for work, but we actually have her on Zoom. Oh. Good, wish so badly I could be there in person, but work always comes first. Yeah, Jeremy dodged a bullet by her not being there. <laughs> She's way too good at roasting, bro. So Jeremy, first things first. Yet there's a third woman whose mother went on social media and said that you two were actually engaged mm -hmm. while you were applying for this experiment. So Laura's like, I've been working with her hard on this. <laughs> yes, I was previously engaged. Everybody I dated was well aware of that. Laura, how does that sound to you? Um, he did mention that he had a fiance before. Okay, then why are we calling him out? Come on. <laughs> why on earth did you lie about your location? 
after you shared it with Laura. Cause he's a guy. <laughs> is what we do. <laughs> All we do is lie. Sarah Ann was actually telling other people the exact same lie. So they had corroborated on that together that they had never left the parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> Partners in crime, look at him, man. For him to go meet her behind my back, I just knew it was sketchy. You are not waiting for me. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that cut? I, lo I love the, the Zoom call. Yeah, it would be really funny if Laura had to raise her hand every time before she wanted to speak. You sat and told him shit about me. In the Why is she staring me down? Where are you? Yeah, what the hell? You're the pick-me girl. Right, You're the pick-me girl. You're the pick-me girl. Don't Don't act whoa, 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 whoa. We got crossfires? Why are we getting Kwame reactions? Yes, I'm very happy with the way it turned Just out. like you said you would. If we were in the audience, get that bit! <laughs> Just chatting. Well, so. you guys saw me stand up and get walked out on by Matt. Is it that shocking that I was talking till five in the morning? Everybody knows I can talk. It's not that. All right, that was kind of. A, oh like that. God, that was that. Yeah, that was a little cringe. Laura's cooking something right now. <laughs> She's cooking. I think they're both disgusting. <laughs> Wait, Laura kind of looked like one of the piranhas in The Little Mermaid, or maybe the eels, maybe flounder. Really? I don't believe a single word that he says. I think he was a literal fucking clown robot in the pod. Well then why'd you say yes to marry him? <laughs> what? It happened last Saturday, all he's been fucking talking about is his image and how he looks worse than Jimmy. So I don't know why the fuck he came on this show, but it sure- <laughs> Jimmy catching strays, bro. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> I don't know what the Jimmy context was about, but yeah, sorry appreciate about- Appreciate the strays. Sorry. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he was mad about it. That's true. It, I don't recall saying that, but if I did say that, I was- Clearly it was on your mind. You're still talking about me and your own relationships and stuff. <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy! Bop, bop, bop. <laughs> That's because she liked to unfollow us and still follow our fiancés at the lake day, which I thought was strange. <laughs> Let Sarah Ann have some options, you know? She got a bag of it. Well, Sarah Ann, I have to ask you about- did a video uh, that appears to show you living oh, in Jeremy's home. Nick is like, let me get my producer take in here. Why the hell did you spoil his reunion? This is a reality television. It is meant to entertain you. And we didn't miss with this one, baby. We didn't miss. <laughs> this is a Joker video, dude. <laughs> oh, God. First of all, Sarah Ann, you've had a year to reach out to me. Like, we had that little lake day party. Why would she? What the fuck is the point of reaching out to her? Yeah. Hey, girl, fucking your ex. How do you feel about that? <laughs> Wedding? that was made a mockery of by the two of you. My take is Laura prefers this outcome to drag <laughs> people on live television. Um, thank you so much for joining us today. We wish you the very Wait. best. No, yes, we're not what? Gonna we're not gonna discuss bean dip. <laughs> oh, please no. <laughs> Why would she throw herself under the bus? Yeah, what, what the fuck was that? AD was my very close friends in the lounge and the pod. We were playful. I'm a goofball. You should've just let it die, Laura. Ew. Join me in welcoming the mullet man himself. It's Trevor Tab. Oh gosh. Oh, what the hell is that facial hair? That was a scared walk. Yeah. Where well, you got the Wolverine card? I know. <laughs> People were posting, protect Trevor at all costs. Then something came out. Aaron and Joe exposed <laughs> Trevor. <laughs> and the girlfriend that you had at the same time that you were participating in this experiment. We actually have the text, so let's go. <laughs> What did he show up to, like, what? Trevor says, I hope you know how much I love you and had to pretend that this wasn't real life to say anything I said. What you have to say about that? <laughs> <laughs> Valid. Nah, say it with your chest. You gotta just tell the truth at this point if you're back in your corner. I, I had a whole thing planned to say. Now he's emotional? <laughs> oh. I don't know. <laughs> god, this is, oh god, it's so cringe. Yeah. So. This is uh, the worst thing you could do. Fucked up that I was acted like that with someone else right before going on. Like, I want to try it. This still doesn't help your case because then you're fucking over the girl you're texting. You're saying I love you. Yes. To this woman as you're entering the experiment. <laughs> <laughs> so toxic that after you got out of the pods, you that, said, I'm going I to marry was, you? No, that, I, yes, yes. I'm, I'm toxic as well. Clay dabs him up. <laughs> Yo, therapy session with my boy Trev. <laughs> New podcast, Clay and Trevor, bro. Do you guys want to say anything? Chelsea, drag him. I definitely am not here to grill you by any means. I'm here to air fry you. You little chicken tender. No. 
I think it's just disrespectful because we all put... You had five minutes of screen time the whole season, Brittany. <laughs> you had a partner and Trevor got more screen time than you. Can I, like, just leave right now? Go ahead. Chelsea has been raked over the coals. No, over the past no, and I will give and Chelsea... And I thought, didn't he just say, can I leave right now? Yeah, but then they didn't let him. I was myself in those pods. I hope you know that. You're the only person that I owe any response to. They're gonna go smash after the show now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Jimmy's pretty quiet for being a cricket. Am I right, guys? I ain't hear no chirping. Hey, participating in Love is Blind, it's really a once in a lifetime opportunity. You can see the results. Look around this room. Look at this couch right here. That was a, that was a $300 <laughs> couch. We, could, we afforded that. It's not what this is about. It's not fair to the audience. It's not fair to Aaron and Joe. It's, not fair it's never fair to us. So, Trevor, I know you asked to leave. You can leave now, man. Oh my God. Goodbye, Trevor. On that note. <laughs> The exit shot. A couple that we were really rooting for, AD and Clay. Were we really rooting for them? We were concerned for <laughs> AD. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think anyone was rooting for them. So who contacted who first to get together? Call me, duh. Yeah, I got a couple of like, uh, messages that wasn't responded to. But, uh, <laughs> you up? What you doing? The Body. You know, AD really seen me through. She's she's honestly the love of my life, and I will tell you honestly. Oh <laughs> my God! <laughs> the morality of like, am I a good person? Am I a bad person? And I will tell you honestly, I did make a mistake. You know, going to the altar and saying no. I think he just wants to fuck around, dude. <laughs> I think that's what it is. The whole bad person thing comes from, am I a loyal enough person to commit to a long term marriage? AD, that was like. A, a roller coaster of emotions. I'm We're gonna buy out the theme park for you guys. Do you think you would ever date him again? No, don't do it. Next question. <laughs> Clay, would you ever date her again? Thousand percent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching it back, and it broke my heart to break your heart, honestly. <laughs> it broke my heart to oh, okay. break your heart. Okay, okay. Can we get a halftime show with him rocking out with AD? Johnny and Amy, you guys also have a fun and funky relationship. <laughs> Are you wearing a condom now, Johnny? <laughs> All right, so today on Johnny's Kitchen, we're going to be making some... <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna make it beating. All right, guys, thirty thousand likes on the video. Me and Jim will do this. Um, Autumn is still over the moon excited. <laughs> show Jimmy. She's loving it. I didn't let her watch the show in its entirety. Why would you show your daughter this show? Which in turn is gonna help her. God, y'all know I cannot talk about her without losing it. <laughs> then let's move on, cause we don't care. This is for Johnny and Amy. Oh, come on, where's the drama? Were condoms not an option? <laughs> oh, never mind. Uh, condoms were always an option. But <laughs> fuck that. <laughs> I can't feel a damn thing. I want my dick wet. I never ended up going on birth control. He never got a vasectomy. But yeah, no, we figured it out and that's all that yeah. matters. What did they do? Finger each other? But Chelsea, I have a question for you. What did you think about the conversation Jessica and Laura had about Jimmy when they met up at the bar? Oh yeah, because Laura and Jessica had a talk like, yeah, Jimmy would probably want to meet you. I obviously, it's not a secret, had insecurities during the show. I Did you pick up on that? I didn't pick up on that. No, I thought she was really confident. Wildly disrespectful. And I don't expect any grace for that. That was not my best moment. Yeah, I just don't understand why Jessica's digging in on Sarah Ann. Like, you're not a girl's girl. You're not a girl's girl. Yeah, and then, and then she... her and Laura did the exact same thing to Chelsea. Well, viewers obviously got to see that moment where you guys saw each other at the lake, but they were pretty disappointed they didn't get a chance to see your reaction when you saw a picture of her. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Nick, let's go. Did you, in fact, choke? As Jessica predicted you would. He's like, yeah, Jeremy's penis was in her mouth. <laughs> Jess doesn't need me to tell her this, but you're absolutely stunning. You're gorgeous. Rizzler. Oh, yeah, I saw your friend request come through and I was like, is that who I think it is? And I was like, oh my God, it is. It's the fucking cricket. <laughs> um, Jeremy showed me the picture in, in the gym. We were working out. Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> These two guys, oh my God. Are you and Jimmy friends? I thought we were. Whoa! <laughs> Until he tried to make a move? And then when the show came out, I didn't think it was going to be to the extent that it was. All the hate that he and Chelsea were receiving. 
Oh, <laughs> uh, 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 you do anything? We don't hate them. They're just stupid. I saw an interview that you did recently, and I was infuriated. What the hell did Jimmy say? <sighs> that 10 minutes into our one of our last dates that I just stormed out, which also wasn't true. The way you talked to me during our last date. It's so weird to see Jimmy so confrontational. And he's like different man with the beard and everything. Her leaving the date early, that did happen. An hour and a half into it, not 10 minutes. I'd maybe give you 45 minutes, but it felt like 10 minutes to me. <laughs> Dude, no. why the fuck are we doing this? This is so boring. I thought we were on good terms, the, the, but I guess so we're not. I mean, I have an opinion too. And Gigi's water breaks. Oh my god, I need to deliver this baby now. We're gonna deliver a baby live on Love is Blind. <laughs> Nicholas Shane and Vanessa are like, buzz, buzz. Hey, Chelsea. The comparison to Megan Fox. Did you bring her? Please welcome. <laughs> Trevor's girl. <laughs> That was a good one. Vanessa, that was funny. Um, what are your thoughts? Okay, before we hear Chelsea's take on this, she knew what she was doing in the pods <laughs> because she acted like she didn't know Megan Fox's name. She said, um, MGK's girlfriend or wife or whoever it is. That's the thing that, that's why like, I don't feel bad for roasting her about it is because like, you know what you're doing. Yeah. You know that that was cheating on Love is Blind. Love is supposed to be blind and you're like, I look like this celebrity. Then, like, you know that you're getting the edge on Jessica. That's a little bit of a snake move to Jessica. The world is harsh. And you could say anything. You could say, I like the color pink, and people are gonna demolish you. Why the fuck would you like pink? <laughs> fucking dumbass color. Making humor of it, and it, it is what it is. Thanks, guys. <laughs> So we're gonna get a picture of Megan Fox and Chelsea side by side. Zach and Bliss from season yeah. four. We're excited to share with you a clip from their recent baby shower. Take a look. What the, what is this? <laughs> oh my God, he looks insane. Imagine having Zach as your fucking dad, dude. <laughs> Sorry, battery. How freaking dare you? It's me. Why the fuck you see that? Uh, I don't want to make you uncomfy, but did either of you just want to, you know, comfy. like do it and see if that created the crave? That's what you said. Yeah, no, that's that was the first thing I said. I'm going to wait until marriage and I should not have to first test that out to then make my decision. Mm. I completely disagree. If you were in the audience, yeah, it's, uh, it's echoing through the whole entire like stage. Nick is like, we got we got someone in the crowd objecting. What do you have to say about that, Brittany? Uh, yeah, Joe from Aaron and Joe here. I just think that you should have gotten your pussy wet. When we get into the phase of like really dating other people, how that affect us? We're extremely close. We talk every day. Then just date. If you end up finding a different person, how are you gonna explain like, oh, I'm friends with my ex-fiance on a dating show. Have you heard of Love is Blind? And then they're like, yeah, I've watched Aaron and Joe. Life happens, kids, job, and you start getting snippy. Mm -hmm. And this is the person that you're supposed to be the most respectful <laughs> to. And I I fucking hate this guy, bro. There's the snippiness. <laughs> I'm spicy. <laughs> uh, how much money do I have to pay to unsee that? A Matthew. He was invited to attend this reunion, but he uh, politely declined. Matthew, idiot. You could have been a funny guy. Did you ever reconnect with Matthew after the show? I did. You hit a Matthew after the show? He's like drilling a hole in my, the side of my head. Does Clay not know about yeah, this? Yeah, is this news to you, Clay? Uh, <clears throat> no, it's not. Just... Okay. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Matthew and I, we went on a few dates. Oh, oh no. AD, how, she is the best at ignoring red flags, isn't she? You know, Matthew kind of cute. Like, low key, he's cute, y'all. Like, respectfully. <laughs> this is so fucking cringe. Clay, you want to go run some laps and get this out of your system? <laughs> that was a good one. Absolutely. I have an amazing privilege and honor to help cast for Love is Blind. So it's her we have, fault. We have no chance. She's seen our videos. They hate it. We're blacklisted, bro. Become a Patreon. We'll buy out Love is Blind. We'll buy the show. We do what we want with it. That's right. Mike and Izzy will actually be joining me on the next season of Perfect Match coming this summer along with Jessica.
<laughs> oh, oh shit. You guys hide for a perfect match? That poor daughter. You're going on another show, <laughs> Mom? Yes. Don't leave me alone again. So Izzy, what's been going what's on with up? you since the last time we saw you? Catch us up. Not much, man. Just enjoying life. I'm growing some hair. I think the best part of it all is the credit's fixed. Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! What do you miss most about being on Love is Blind? I mean, you're the you're the OGs now. The original gangsters. Oh, brother. Thank you to our season six friends for opening your hearts and sharing your journeys with us. Well, that was season six of Love is Blind. Pretty good, pretty good season. Pretty bad reunion. It was a little long and boring. But it was kind of fun at the same time. Guys, we're going to be putting out one more video on the season. We're going to be putting together a best of moments. Our funniest or cringiest show moments. All put together in one video. If you ever feel like going back and watching the videos, you can just watch that video. Because it's going to be a compilation of the best moments. If you guys want to subscribe to our Patreon, it helps us out a lot. We just ate a bunch of cereal and ranked it. Head on over to Patreon. You'll get your sweet treat. So, uh, yeah. Thank you, guys for watching this season with us. Subscribe, and we got more videos coming. Stay tuned.